Hey, Ryan Matt Borden here, aka Loopline. Hope you're having a great day. In this video, we're going to look at how to get keywords from a list of URLs. So I got five random URLs here. I'm going to go to grab check, grab keywords from harvested URL list, which is that list of URLs. We've got a lot of settings here. We've got some markers. I can put in markers here. I just put in random words. I can put in numbers. These are markers on the page. So we can grab keywords that are between these markers. So if I wanted to grab keywords from something specific on the page, I could put that in. And we'll just run it. You can see real quick. I don't get a whole lot of results with car and truck if I put in like one and three. Uh, because there happens to be a one and a three on these two pages, then I'm going to get even less keywords. It's also subjective to the rest of these settings, which connections and timeouts, uh, you can change these to whatever works for you. But this KW here, this is the number of characters. So I'm looking currently for keywords that have a minimum of three characters and a maximum of four characters. And we can look at what we just scraped, which is this one here where we got the three. So we can see no more than three and no more than four characters. If I take this away and just put this to zero with a maximum of four characters, for example, we'll see another file pop up here and you can see everything and of course we can take it away and put everything to zero and it just maxes everything out and then we get a lot of keywords and we get everything under the sun all the way down to one letter. So it's picking up X and that sort of stuff. So you can adjust those settings as you see fit. Also under settings there is edit stop words. This is just a list of really common words that you don't probably need for most cases, but you can edit them if you would prefer to use different stop words. And then there's a bad words list and you can turn on and off bad words list and then filter most common HTML tags and then strip scripts and strip styles. That's HTML, so scripts would be like JavaScript, etc., and styles. And so we can turn on all those features if we want and enable these bad words and then run it and it'll make sure there's not any random HTML setting up in there and um, or styles and I can filter the most common HTML tags etc so that I get different so basically a lot of options a lot of filters when we're all done and we get our big list of keywords we can export them we can save them to the main keyword memo which is this right here we can save them to a file, which is just a text file. We can save URLs with a keyword as a count to a text file, so it'll give us the count plus the keyword. And then we can save URLs as Excel file with the count. And so that is how you can grab keywords from a list of URLs. If you don't have Scrapebox, click the link up here now or go to scrapebox.com and you can roll down here and pick up your copy and if you miss it it's in the video description down below thanks for watching this scrapebox video for more scrapebox videos click the subscribe button down below and then click the bell and then check out these other great scrapebox videos